Hello everyone, Linda Israel here, and this is January 2nd creative prompt, and I'll read it to you today. Today is use something blue today and write about what you want to accomplish this year. These are daily prompts that we'll have in the month of January. They're being shared here on YouTube, on my blog, as well as the Friendly Junk Journal People Facebook group. So you can get the complete list there. We'll do seven at a time. And then, of course, daily we will share those. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe and give me a thumbs up if you like this video. And, of course, share it with your friends to inspire them as well. I try to say that anytime on social media. If you enjoy something that you're looking at, watching, reading, whatever it may be, share it so others find it too. That's the best word of mouth. It doesn't cost you anything but a few minutes to get it done. All right, so use something blue today and then write about something you want to accomplish this year. So I was digging around in my stash. I've got my journal here that I've made and I found a, I guess it's a Bible page that I use to do a gel print on. So this is a five by seven gel print and it just so happens to fit right on side my page here. So I think what going to do right off the bat is I'm just going to glue this down to this page here. So find my glue. I'm just using a Lean's Tacky Glue. I'm just going to go around the perimeter and then kind of make a zigzag in the middle. This paper is too thin to make it a pocket, but if your paper is thicker, you could make it into a pocket. I'm going to flip this over because there's holes in this page and I don't want to smush that down and then have my pages adhered together. So I'm just rubbing over that to get any glue. Okay, so I've got that adhered down, and I think what I'm going to do is, I know it means maybe silly, but because my journal is mostly red, I thought, well, I've got this red, white, and blue, it's, I call it postal tape, but I thought it might look kind of neat if I framed that gel print. So let me grab my scissors, and I'm just going to frame this gel print with that washi tape. Remember when you're using washi tape and you pull it to lay, don't pull it tight. Give it a little bit of slack and then just gently lay it into place. And then that will keep your page from curling. So that's kind of adding a little bit of red to it. And I've got a journal card here. This is from the Radiant Red. That's also from the Radiant Red kit. And I think that might look kind of neat in the corner down here. I'm going to make it a tuck spot even though I don't need it to be a tuck spot, but I think I like that. So I'm going to add it right here. So those of you that don't like your handwriting, you know, what you can do is, as I have made a little tuck spot here, you can make a journal card that's pretty on the front and on the back side, you write whatever you want and then you won't see it when you open the journal unless you physically turn the card over. So I just wanted to share that little tip with you. Another tip you could do is type out everything that you want to say in your journal on a computer, print it and paste it in. So there's another way to do that as well. All right, so I think what I wanna do now is we're gonna talk about the writing prompt, write about what you want to accomplish this year. And I think I'm going to use this little saying, be a difference maker. I've got a Sharpie no bleed pen. This is pens that I use because they don't bleed through to the other side when you write. That's why I like them. And they write over many surfaces as well as painted pages. So these are Sharpie no bleed pens that I'm using. For January, I'm going to just... January the 2nd, all right, for 2020, I'm going to write that um, I want to be a difference maker in the crafting community. I want to inspire people to create. Maybe people who have never, you know, picked up a rubber stamp, a stencil, acrylic paint, a paintbrush, whatever it may be, a journal and write in. I hope to inspire people. So I want to be a difference maker that inspires people. So I'm going to write that into my journal and then I'll be right back. I had a little boo-boo. I didn't meant to write B. So I'm going to use a paper punch and 
I'm just going to add a little heart right over that. Another version of white out. <laughs> I want it to be a difference maker in 2020. Okay, so there is my journal page. It says, I want to be a difference maker in 2020 to inspire people to create. I want to share tutorials and projects. I, I will share tutorials and projects throughout the year to inspire others to create. Doing what I love has been a dream and now it has come true and I get to do what I love daily. So thankful for the opportunity to share my passion with the world. So that is today's prompt. I hope that it inspires you to be creative and be a difference maker in 2020. If you will, create your page, your project, and then take a picture and share it in the event in the Friendly Junk Journal People Facebook group. Again, the prompts are just here to give you a suggestion. So if you don't want to, you don't have to. It's just the idea of sharing your thoughts with the rest of us. All right, everybody. Thanks so much for watching. Come back tomorrow for the next prompt and have a fabulous day. Bye, everybody.